inside? Yeah. Wow, it's like a spaceship. He's got a mini fucking bar in here. <laughs> oh, here comes the owner. And that's the owner. Yep. Of Hello, owner of the fancy car. <laughs> Expensive car, he only puts $10 a gas. <laughs> Isn't that crazy? <laughs> that's, that's why he keeps the car. <laughs> hey, I gotta give you a pound on this. <laughs> <laughs> That's how they do it in Alabama. So we have a Lamborghini Aventador here. A customer came in stating that there was a lot of noise coming from the engine bay. After Javier did the so after Javier did the inspection on the car, uh, we did come to find out that the pulleys, the tensioner, uh, they're all pretty much worn out. So this car has almost 30,000 miles. It's a little too early for that to happen, but it's possible. So we're doing that. We're changing all the pulleys, the tensioners, also the serpentine belt, and doing a service on the car, oil filter change. And this car will be ready tomorrow. There's something on the bumper that I want to show you guys. I cannot. Please be starting to blur out. Okay. We have a Urus. Is this the S? This is the Urus S. It has the full 1016 wide body kit on it. This one we didn't do. Um, however, we have a Quicksilver exhaust for it, so we're installing the Quicksilver exhaust. It's a satin silver color, and it has some really, really crazy Forgiato wheels on it. This car actually belongs to one of the Forgiato owners. Also, the parking sensors are acting up, so we're gonna check that out for him. So once we get this down, we're gonna show you how cool the satin silver looks. I don't know if I, yeah, we did one or two satin silver Uruses, but never a wide body, so it's cool to see. Mine was not satin silver, mine was satin chrome. Satin chrome, there's a difference. I hated that wrap, by the way, because it was like very patchy. But this is regular satin silver, so we're gonna get it off, uh, start it up too, and uh, show you guys this cool car. Talking to him for two weeks. Oh yeah, he didn't talk to me for two weeks. That's yeah, why he because, wasn't on the YouTube channel. Yeah, because he broke my heart. He, promised, really? he, he promises me something what? and he broke his promise. So what do you call that man? Whenever he promised something and broke it. A bitch. No. Uh, okay, hold on. Not promise. Santos. Ah, you, not promise Santos, man. when you promise something and you break your promise, what do you call that person? Liar. Oh, liar. You liar, bitch. Yeah, you liar. <laughs> hey, you lawyer. Come on, lawyer. lawyer. He's lawyer. You know we pay for this shit, right? Oh. This guy used the whole tape. Why is it like See? that? See? Because it's in Sarkis, it's the only chocolate that was right. You couldn't screw it up. I was actually going to keep that for memory, but now it's wrong. What did you Oh, it's the, it's the one that the, nobody has. Why'd you change it? This, this is discontinued. Well, no, I do like it. The reason why is because I drive a lot, so there's oh. like, bug, like bug, the... Bug. Um, the yeah. chips, yeah, rock yeah, chips. Yeah. Okay, we'll yeah. put a new one. Just one row, one row, that's it. Yeah. Six yeah, you don't need. He's never worked this hard ever. No. I can't. Nope, nope. There's the first time he actually yeah, went like this. this. Is actually, the most he's <laughs> I've never seen touched him. the floor. It's very rare. Really? Yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah. He's a gentleman. You're very, very nice guy. Yeah. You guys, we're sorry, kids. <laughs> well, you know how strong this tape is. Yeah, but this if you just put four corners, it'll never come. You see how long it came off? How long did it like you? Yeah, it was on for a year. Nothing ever happened. Yeah. There you go. Whoa. Yeah, go for Crazy. If you want to use your knees, go ahead here. <laughs> use your knees. It's gonna take 12 hours to do that too, bro. <laughs> I wonder if End break time. <laughs> Alright, so we have this uh, McLaren 600 LT. Um, this is a very, very nice, beautiful McLaren, you guys. We're still waiting on some, uh, some of the good stuff on this car that's not here yet. But so far, we have done, we've done a satin dark gray wrap with door jams. We did the uh, wheels 
gloss black, powder coated in gloss black. Right now we're currently waiting for the wing, the wing on the car, and we're waiting for the trunk bit as well, which is going to be carbon as well. Also, we're putting some orange seat belts in this thing to give it a little bit of nice color from outside as well. And uh, that's about it for this guy. But almost there. It's going to look really nice when it's all done. Just a quick little update for you guys. many my box we've done so far but there's another one and this is obviously the v12 version the 680 this customer had a white regular my that we did all these modifications to and unfortunately he was a victim of a attempted robbery and they actually shot at his car the car had maybe six or seven bullet holes all over it and he was very lucky that he uh, was uninjured that car came here, went through insurance, and we actually ended up fixing it, and that car got sold. So now, he got this brand new S680, which is obviously better, but he got it in black. Only thing he's done on it, RDB monoblock wheels. These are obviously our most popular wheel for this Maybach. It is the cleanest for sure on this car. Nothing beats this. Uh, we are able to make this in three piece. You could also do this on BMWs, Range Rovers, G-Wagons, it doesn't matter. I'm looking for a client that wants to do actually a G-Wagon with these, maybe in a three-piece. I think that'll look incredible. We added the Maybach emblems on the hood and the rear trunk. The trunk one lights up just like the side ones, which we also program the side ones to work at all times with the car because it only works with lock and unlock through the factory. So we've done plenty of these. Super clean with the black and chrome all over. You can't go wrong, especially if the V12 has that mesh in the front that's all chrome. Really, really clean look. Hope you guys enjoy it. You might hear a lot of banging noises. That's because uh, we're doing a quarter panel replacement on a G-Wagon. A lot of heavy work on the frame machine going on over there. <laughs> but right here is a Euros front lip. This is actually in carbon fiber, as you can see. This came off of that last uh, brush black Euros that we did. This customer wanted to make his front lip more aggressive than the 1016 kit. He wanted actually to look like my Urus, which has these extended areas. So whatever you see green here is actually extended. It comes out this much more um, all around. And as you can see the design, and then it has uh, two legs sticking out from the sides. This is all handmade, all designed. Luis, the master's doing this. We're gonna have this done tomorrow and then we're gonna actually wrap it brush black to match the wrap of the car. And of course, I got the new RDB signature wheels. So this car is gonna look updated, it's gonna look more aggressive and it's gonna look amazing. Our good buddy Alesso owns it, who's that big, big DJ. So yeah, it's not finished. That's why you see these things. It's still drying. Uh, once it dries, he's gonna be able to shape it more and then add some you know, final filler on it to smoothen it out and then it'll get primered and then wrapped. Good friend, suck his fucking hand. I'm not sucking his fucking hand. <laughs> Let him suck his own fucking hand. <laughs> no, another person has to do it. Huh? Oh, he or can he, do it. He can reach it. Or, or if you pee on it, it might work, right? Yeah. Is that what it is? Pee on it. That's a jellyfish. Okay, pee right? on it and then suck it out. Ah, hey! Don't forget to subscribe and like the video. And also, if you have any comments, good or bad, leave it below. All right. So, see you on the next one. Haha! <laughs>